Hi! So for today's vlog, I thought I would talk about uh, journals and sketchbooks and stuff like that because I've been, um, I really like watching people's, uh, talk they're talking about their sketchbooks and their journals and their diaries and things that they keep in them and uh, I'm kind of a journal lover, sketchbook lover. Like, it, every time I go into the bookstore, I'm like, I have to browse up and down the aisles of the journal section and sketchbook section just because I love them. I start off um, with my earliest ones uh, that I have and then work up to the latest that I have right now. Uh, journals first, and then I'll talk about the sketchbooks. I got this journal in like 2001 when I was like, uh, when I was like 10, I, I don't know, it was quite a while ago, in 2001, and it looks like this, little diary with a little clasp, and it's pink and fuzzy, and I wrote in this for like four, or sorry, I got it in 2002. 11? I think I was 11 when I got this. It was like at Claire's, one of that, um, that jewelry place. And I love this thing. I wrote in it like a lot up until 2005 when I turned like, when I got my next journal. Because this one, I only wrote in it up to like this point and all of this isn't written in. I don't know, oh, there. All that isn't written in. So I got pretty close to finishing this one, but I didn't. 2005, like right when I ended doing that one, and it's um, this journal that says, I hope you dance journal. And it has like little, and it, you can put like a, your own picture in here where um, you can open it up and like there's little corner thingies that you stick down. You draw your own little picture and you put it in there and you measure it out. And I thought that was like the greatest thing ever when I was like, 14. And this one I actually did finish as writing in here and it has like drawings and which I like which I like drew over and stuff. I really love this journal. This was like my favorite journal because I could like do that. <laughs> A lot of them where it's like you don't and then like some most of them are like huge. Uh, I'm like really particular about my journals for some reason. I don't know why. Um, it's just when you're writing, I guess. Uh, but I, I, this one took me. I finished this one. I got this one in 2005, and I finished it in the, like the end of 2007. So it was like two years. It was, this journal served me well for two years. And an, another uh, notebook that I kept alongside with that one, the hope, I, I hope you dance journal. This is just this notebook. It has like the just a regular notebook and it's like falling apart now. It's been like forever. But I like drew on it drew on it with Sharpie and stuff and um this one was more like I stuck stuff in it and I I did write in it, but I also like stuck drawings and like my <laughs> pages are falling out. I didn't like this journal as much because the pages fell out easily. Um it was easy to, you know, write in or whatever. Let's see if it's wrong. Oh, it's kind of full. Let it down. And stuff like stickers and drawings and all of that. And this is another drawing. I, I think I drew that and stuck it in there. I like that one too. I had that one around the same time and I'd switch off and on between journals just because I don't know why I did that. Um, sometimes I would uh, just depending on which um, one I wanted to write in. In 2008, it was probably shortly after I finished the Black Notebook and the I Hope You Can Dance journal. So I, uh, this one I got at, I probably got it at like uh, Borders. And it has this pretty binding on it, a really nice cover. Oh, I love this cover. This is such a pretty cover. I have a um, little metal clasp here that clicks on and my note pen. Um, I should write in this journal more because I want to finish this one 
just because it's such a pretty journal. I think I, I've gotten like a lot of it done. This is, this is uh, these are the empty pages right on this side. Um, so hopefully I'll finish that. Another one that I have is this one, which it actually didn't look like this when I got it. My sister got this um, journal in the mail from like some kind of mailing list and she didn't want it. So I was like, yeah, I'll take it. I like journals. This all apart and I decoupaged all these um, words on there from a magazine. And then I just, I basically just tore out the inside pages. So I uh, cut it, you know, down the middle right here on each side of the, of this, still sticky, cut down on right here and took, and I just took out the pages, did all the, the front cover and stuff and made sure to keep this intact and then the little ribbon thing too, I kept that intact. It was a fun project. So moving on to sketchbooks, which don't have lined pages. Got this one uh, from, I think it was from my sister. She got it from someone. I haven't really used this one yet. Uh, I'm not much of a fan of these kind of sketchbooks, but it's good paper. I'll still use it. For my birthday last summer, my dad got me these, like, giant... Uh, I don't know what they're called, but he wrote on it notes, drawings, musings, doodles, thoughts kept for prosperity, which I thought was very thoughtful. A lot of pages, and I have two of those, both the same. <laughs> and I, I, I do like these journals, and I'll find a use for them someday, hopefully, for notes, drawings, musings, doodles, thoughts kept for prosperity. Are my sketchbook. I think I got this one in my art 100 or 101 class in college, and I feel that like most of it, like that, that much, this, this much is filled up, that much is not. I'm not sure when I got this one, it was probably like in 2010. This one, this one is. Um, I got, it, it, it's pretty much exactly the same, except it doesn't have like the, um, the textured surface. This one has like a textured surface. I actually like, I think I like the the smooth one better. But you know, can't be too picky. It's still a sketchbook, still nice. Um, this one I have is actually really full. And this was just last year. This was actually a photograph that I took of my cat Oliver. And then this was the study that I did, I drew. This one is very recent that I like too, from just the past year. Pretty! I love this one. I thought that one turned out nice too. I really like this one too, it's very nice. Get a close up on that for you. That was all my sketchbooks. Uh, thank you for watching if you made it this far. And um, I hope to see uh, some video responses. I like to see a video response of sketch if you keep sketchbooks and journals. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, subscribe if you want to keep up with my videos. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Bye!